Spotify AI. You may have already played around with Replica AI, which actually boasts 20 million users, not 10 million anymore, and is based on a pre-trained version of GPT-2, so far less than 1 billion parameters. One of the guys from Replica has split out to a company called Botify. His name is Artem Rodachev, and uh, he lives not very far from me, actually. The application is really kind of cool. It's not uh, powerful, but what it can do is incredible. And I just wanted to give a, a first look here today so that we can play around with it. So my screen is, is uh, mirrored there on the right hand side, and we may or may not have to use the browser here. This is Botify, botif.ai if you're looking for that website, and that will allow you to download this for either iOS or for Android. But essentially what it is, we'll jump into the app store for a moment. Just searching for Botify. There we go. Essentially what it is, is an application that allows you to design and then speak to your own avatar. And it will even animate using AI your photo into a, a moving image that will have the lips move and the eyes move and the face move. So it's really kind of cool. Let me show you uh, an example of creating one from scratch. I'm going up to create bot at the top and then we'll grab an avatar from my gallery. Got some ridiculous ones here. Let's actually use Laban who played Lita for me in one of the seasons when we had no avatar to use. So what it's doing right now is going away and using style GAN or something similar. It's taking that photo of Laban and it's animating the mouth and the face so that we can use that directly. Um, that's pretty impressive. Here is the output. So all I gave it was that single photo and it's got the blinking eyes. It's got the uh, slightly moving mouth, but that will move more when he's speaking. And even the neck and the upper body that are part of the photo have been animated. So really quite cool. Let's call him uh, Laban2 because I do have another Laban in there. I don't know, won't let me do that. What about Labana? <laughs> So now we're using the equivalent of a very small GPT model. The style GAN stuff, the animation of the bot is what I'm talking about today because Spotify have done a fantastic job with that. I guessed here that the model was quite small. I said it might be less than 3 billion parameters and I'm right. This is currently based on GPT Neo, uh, the original one at 2.7 billion, but it will be bigger and bigger. So we allow the user here to put in some prompts. So for Laban, I'm going to say, I'm actually from New Zealand. Yes. And uh, I love to be courageous. And my favorite food is steak. You can keep going with this. I'm just going to put three in here, but you can do quite a long list of bullet points, which become its prompt. And we can choose a voice here. I'm going to choose Miguel because I think it'll be closest. Just realized the audio won't come through, which is kind of boring, but it gives it, it gives you a, an option of a number of voices and uh, you can essentially hear your person talking. You can also talk at it because this gives you access through to the iOS microphone and API there. What's your favorite food? I love to be courageous. This is what I was talking about with the brain, which might not be quite there yet. Where do you live? What is the Pope's name?
Not too bad with a training data set that ends 2018, 2019. Not too bad. How do I get to Mexico? <laughs> All right, so nowhere near something like GPT-3 with its massive data set. This is another one that I created. <laughs> a nice looking guy who's working in the world and enjoying it while talking with a cigar in his mouth. I even had a fairly funny uh, animation of Steve Hardison here. <laughs> so we'll just ask, whoops, maybe that's why I should use the audio. What car do you drive? Cool. Well done to Artem and team. Botify AI is a really good alternative to something like Emerson. Keep in mind that Emerson is usually using the 175 billion parameter model. So at 2.7 billion parameters right now, this is far, far smaller. But I love the StyleGAN animation of essentially a static photo which becomes completely animated when it's talking to you. And you can have it of anything. You could have it of your dog or your cat or your partner, and you've got something right there on your phone. <laughs> Thanks, guys. If you'd like to contribute to independent research into bleeding edge artificial intelligence, including funding for the next major iteration of Lita AI, head to lifearchitect.ai gift.